Welcome everyone, GamerCop here. This is episode 40 of my gameplay on Fishing North Atlantic. So, today we're back in the double trouble. We're going to go do some long line fishing today, I think. Or not long line. We're going to go do some deep line fishing for um, some tuna and some swordfish. We are in the correct season. I fast forwarded us there. That is why I paid off one of our loans and then, oh wow, we actually got <laughs> um, bank. Yeah, so we owe a couple of these guys still some money. They've been charging us a little bit of extra stuff there, but uh, we're going to have to borrow another loan. Uh-oh, you're currently in too much debt for another loan? Oh, no. Okay. Um. Wow, that didn't go well. I shouldn't have paid off that other one. We still would have had a lot of money. I paid off $6 million bucks, but uh, sixty-three grand. Um, We might just be pushing it, but maybe we can make it work. All right, let's see. Rigging. Deep line. Okay, fifteen grand. Um, This boat's already pretty much... It's upgraded, isn't it? Storage. Yeah, we got the biggest storage on it. Um, we don't really need a whole lot else. I think we've updated everything else, so um, we just need to get some fishing gear. So we actually should be fine. A fishing gear. Five deep lines. 32 is a lot of them. Um, anyways, we'll probably only do... Let's try... Can I... Yeah, buy 19, 20 of them. Okay, so we should have 20 of them. Bait deep lines. We're going to try to go for mostly tuna. So I'm going to bait them all with that. They should all be baited with herring. Beautiful. Okay. Now crew. Crew. On board. I'm going to have you all rest at the crew house. We don't really need that many people on board. Um, on board. Or not on board. Sorry. In the crew house. Okay. What do we need? Deep line. Six. Six. Eight. Okay. Sadie's the best so far. You're, of course, the best. Okay, you return to the Devil Trouble, and then we'll take Sadie with us as well. Um, that should be plenty. Just two people should be fine. 4.3%? Yeah, we'll do that. Um, let's go to services. Are we full on... Nope, no, 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 no. Dock, maintenance, buy some fuel. All right, 17 grand in the bank. Um, we are going to go for it. We have... Uh, we're deep line all set here. Let's go to the map. Oh, actually, is there... Um, Sorry, let's go back in here real quick. Is there any tips? Now let's go to the bar. Aha! Yes, that is exactly what we needed. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. nope. Alright, map. Alright, where is that tip for? Three days ago, right down there. Okay, that's fast travel to there. Alright. We'll go right there, and we'll try to head across there. Just delete that point. We don't really need it. All right, right there. Well, maybe more like... We'll try that. See how that goes. Well, that's probably going pretty deep. Yeah, we'll try that. Okay. Let's get uh, someone ready to set deep lines. You're the best of the best. So you go down there, prepare gear. And you guys can actually haul the deep lines by yourself. I don't have to do anything if I don't want to. Might end up doing something, depending on how bad you guys are at it. But uh... Perfect, they're doing their thing. All right, let's get down to the sonar. Oh, look at all those tuna out there. Those are tuna, aren't they? No, those aren't tuna. Those aren't tuna. Never mind, never mind. That's a swordfish there, though, I believe. Um, let's see if we can look for some tuna here. There's a tuna right there, okay. Oh, it's weird that it jumps us in there like that. Alright, he's gonna keep going. Yeah, there's lots of there's, yeah, there's lots of good tuna in here. That's good. Good news for us. We're gonna wait until we get a little bit farther. Oh goodness, there's a lot of them right in there. I don't like that it jumps us into where he's at, but anyhow. So yeah, we'll run a line out here, especially if there's... Gosh, there's so many tuna on there. I want to make some good money off of this. I think we will. Now, we might do two trips this episode. We'll see how this one goes. Or maybe we'll do another trip next episode. Kind of just depends. And I'm hoping to make some good money. I think we need to start paying down those loans, and this might be one of the ways to do it. Uh, but yeah, we just haven't done this in a while, so I figured, you know, why not? Let's go actually go out and do something a little bit different. Um, the next thing we'll probably end up doing maybe is... Gosh, either doing lobster again... Because I know which we have to fast forward time again, but if we either do lobster again, or we could go out and actually just, we might end up having to go out and trawl in between episodes or something, or maybe trawl an episode just to make up some more money because we are 
We do have a lot of debt that we're trying to pay off because we bought all that, all of our nice boats and fun things. But uh, I think we're doing okay. Four deep lines in. Still seeing a lot of fish down there. Not seeing any tuna right now. Swordfish there. Redfish. That might have just been the golden spot. We can always turn around too. I don't see anything. Come on, there's got to be another one out there. I think that might be a tuna at the top. But anyhow, there's a couple of tuna there. Here, I'm seeing some more tuna on there now. Uh, where are we at? Yeah, so tuna must be really good right there. Let's go ahead and clear that out. Um, let's go up, down, and then over, and we'll put another string in there and see how that goes. Maybe we can move you out a little bit. Right there, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Delete that point. Return. What is that buoy right there? Is that someone else's? Not one of our waypoints, I'm pretty sure. No, we don't have a waypoint there. Okay, well. Anyway, we'll keep going here. Okay. Hey, there's lots of them out there. Look at all that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, this seems to be a really good area for them. We can get a good tuna haul. If we can fill up this boat with tuna, that would be fantastic. That would get us probably close to a million bucks, if not more. All right, we're all the tuna. There's another one right there. Beautiful. Catch that guy right there. We got a lot up there, too. There was a lot. I've never seen that many tuna on the sonar before, so that's that's awesome. If we're able to get that kind of uh, result, hopefully we can get that, that many tuna on the actual lines here. Now I'm not seeing anything. Come on now. There's a tuna right there. We'll throw that out. Yeah, it seemed like it was better a little bit up further. Well, here we go. Now we're getting in some more tuna. That's just what we need right there. Yeah, heading down here. We'll see. We'll keep going this way, and if it pans out, it'll be great. Always, we could actually throw another line right up the middle of that, um, too. So this is a really good tip that we got here. Whoever got this tip in really knew that there were tuna out here for sure. Some swordfish down there. We'll wait a little bit here. There's a tuna. We'll throw one out. It's good to get a little bit extra space between them, too. You have a little bit higher chance of getting a little bit more fish. Um, but I think we're doing pretty good right now, so... That's why I don't mind waiting just a little bit longer before I throw another one out. We get a little bit turned here. We get a little bit skewed. All right, let's wait for another tuna to pop up. There's a tuna right there. We'll throw her out. Beautiful. All right, come on. Now we just need to get some money on this boat. Oof, I'm hoping we do good on this. We're, we are definitely a little strapped for cash, as you saw. So uh, we definitely don't have a lot. This needs to be a successful trip, um, especially since we can't take out a loan. I mean, we could always sell a boat, but... There's a few tuna on there, but we don't want to sell a boat if we can avoid it. I really like this boat, too. Um, I think this one, doesn't this one also do crab? Or not crab, but do lobster? We might take this out for lobster as well. This is one of my favorite boats now. <laughs> I'm sad they got rid of the machine gutting station, though. Uh, that was kind of nice, but thankfully we don't have to gut these guys. Um, so we may have only needed really one of these guys, honestly, with us at, at the time. If we don't end up using the other one, I'll take their cutaway. There's another tuna right there. How we doing? We're still heading down that way. Yeah, we'll, we'll get out of there. Keep as long as we keep seeing them on here, I'm no issues throwing them out, but they're starting to get a little bit more sparse. So waiting for any more on here. Come on now. Come on, tuna. There's a tuna right there. We'll throw one out. Alright, we got what do we have? Seven more to throw out. I think it'll be actually I think it'll be a good call to do this. To actually go right up the middle here. And throw some out. Let's try that. Get cruising here again. I think this will be a good. I think this is gonna be a really good spot for us right through here. I mean, obviously it is because we're getting, uh, which we actually probably should put out some of our own markers here. But this is like our our tuna zone. We found a ton of tuna in there. There's another tuna right there. Beautiful. Keep cruising along. Deep lines are pretty easy to throw out too. Pretty low maintenance fishing. You actually make pretty good money off of it too. So if we can get some good weight off this, I know we're not going to probably fill this boat. That'll be a, that'd be a lot of tuna, but still, it'd be nice to get quite a few on board. I bet you 32 lines we might be able to do it, but I haven't done it. Haven't done deep lines in so long that I kind of want to weigh it out and see kind of how it goes before I do anything crazy. So I want to make sure um, it's not going to be too much or anything like that. So. Yeah, I think just seeing how much 20 lines gets us is going to be a good start for that. So there's a couple, or there's at least a tuna down there. Swordfish down there as well. Keep going here. 
Pretty deep out here too, obviously, yeah. Of course, that's kind of what you want when you're doing deep line fishing. There's a tuna there. Oh, there's a... Yeah, I'll throw one out right there. Why not? Three more lines to go. Your last three lines out. Come on, give me some good tuna before we get these lines out. Come on now. There's a tuna at the top of the screen, I think. And there's one. Oh, there's three on the screen now. Beautiful. Throw that baby out. Two more to go. Two more long lines to go. Come on, tuna. All right. And... Hold it, hold it, wait, wait, wait for it. Come on, tuna. Now there's no fish. <laughs> we should run into uh, some here in a little bit. Oh wait, is that, uh, it's hard to see down there. I can see any tuna, there's a tuna right there. All right, we'll throw one out there. One more to go. We just gotta find a, another tuna. There's one right there, but that's okay. He can bite on the other line. And I don't think we've uh, we've done this since they've done a bunch of updates to the game, so it should be interesting to see how it's changed and everything like that. So I'm a little interested about that. But uh, yeah, there's a. I think that's a tuna at the top. But just to be safe, we'll keep going a little bit here. And come on, tuna. There's one right there. We'll we'll get that guy. Beautiful. Well, that is all of our lines. Okay. So it is uh, not very bright out here. That is our that is what a beacon would look like out here. So, anyhow, should tell us we've reached our endpoint if we go up to it. Well, we're gonna pass it anyways. That's okay. Um, we'll clear that. So, actually, what we can do is go up around to here. We got a lot of line lines out there. Look at that. That's our deep lines. It's a lot of deep lines out there. Yeah, definitely all. Oops. Dump, 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 dump all clustered in that little area there so um all right so what i'll do is i'll fast forward some time and then uh we'll keep going actually i might as well just uh probably just leave you guys in for this um so deep lines usually need about what 18 hours let's skip let's skip 17 and see how they're doing oh they're blue there at 17 oh wait that's 18 on there well they're blue at 17 so we probably should start picking them up um okay yeah we'll start picking them up that was that was good good call on that Okay, and we have side thrusters on this, so that should actually help us quite a bit. I'm gonna have you guys, well, I'm gonna actually, me and uh, Michael are gonna do it first, and we're gonna see how well we do, and then we're gonna compare it to you. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Just because if we're gonna lose a ton of fish, I'm not gonna have you do anything. But if it doesn't matter a whole lot, then I don't have any issues with having Sadie pull stuff in, but if it's gonna really affect our bottom line, then I don't wanna do a whole lot with it. All right. Oh, 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 we're coming in a little too hot. Sorry, I was looking at my side thrusters. I was trying to use those to help us out, but I think I ended up making it worse. Come on, you can back up. Oh, almost had it. Almost had it. Get the side thruster off here. There we go. Get it. Nice, nice. Okay. It looks like you got one tuna, two tuna, and a swordfish. Let's get this guy. Can. It's good. Okay. Definitely need to practice on my aim a little bit more. Oof. That's not not a great animation with this uh, this boat. Oh, I missed that. Come on now. Don't be missing fish. Oh, that was only okay. Well, I'm doing terrible. <laughs> this haven't done the deep line fishing in a while. Woo. There we go. We got a perfect, a good, and an okay. So, hey, what can you say? It is what it is. Beautiful. We'll be catching on that. 1,800 pounds. So, yeah, I will definitely be reeling them in. Sadie, you're going to be hanging out in there while I do all the work because um, I know you'll probably get less than me. Well, actually, you know what? Let's just do an experiment. We'll see what we get on board. This is tricky to get these things. It can be tricky. I want to get more lined up too. All right, come on now. They should just pull it in once they can get to it. Oh, I think too much side thruster on that. Too much side thruster. Oh, 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 oh come on. Wrong side of the boat. Unintentionally, of course. I didn't mean to get it on that side of the boat. That wasn't what I was aiming for. All right, we'll just kind of back over it. It'll be fine. 
I like that they got pushed away like that. That's kind of cool. There you guys go. Okay. Are you guys going to do... What do we got on this line here? It's like a tuna there. So one tuna. And it looks like a swordfish. And then another tuna out there maybe. We'll see. That was good. You guys did okay, okay actually. Oh, and then another tuna. Okay, so this will actually be a perfect example to see comparatively how good you guys do. I didn't see what your grading on was that, but 1820, the first one. What did you guys get? Uh, I got slightly more when I did it, so I guess that's not the end of the world, but uh, and it could have been smaller fish and all sorts of different things, but I will try to do it, and I can hopefully get good at it to get some better ratings for us. I'll keep you guys in for a couple more, and I'm obviously not going to keep you guys in while I pull on all, all 20 of them because this might be an hour video. But <laughs> some of you wouldn't mind that. Some of you would get driven over the edge about it. But um, yeah, we'll try to get, maybe get this line pulled in. But I'm going to try to do it, I think, just because I think that's going to give us a little bit better results, especially if I start getting some perfects. That'll help us out a little bit. All right, let's slow it down. We're coming a little hot. A little hot. Oh, easy, easy, easy. Come on now. Slam on the brakes. Okay. A little bit of gas. Just a touch. There we go. Pull it in. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Swordfish, tuna, and that might be just two on this one. There we go. That's what we need. Yeah, maybe just two on this one. Swordfish and a tuna. I have gotten four one time, but that was... I don't think that's the the standard. Well, that was two perfects. So let's see how that did. Okay, so about... 900 pounds so yeah about half as much as what we got when we had three so it's not great <laughs> these waves are tossing us around like crazy out here though come on now you can do it double trouble fight the waves there are some big waves for this little boat Ooh, coming in a little too hot. Come on, turn into it, turn into it. There you go, there you go. Oh, get a little bit of gas. Okay, just a little bit of gas. There we go, there we go. And, oh, there we go, we can haul it. I'll say, you normally it turns up green, so I thought I couldn't do it. Three tuna, this is what I'm talking about. Tuna do way more than the swordfish. So let's get these guys. Oh, that's not what we need. We need perfects. Come on now. We need some perfects. All right, let's go. Let's get this guy. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That was like a just a reaction shot. I don't know. I even wasn't even aiming for anything on that one. All right, come on now. Oh well, at least it's a good. It wasn't a. I thought that was going to be an okay or a missed. I thought that was pretty bad. Okay. All right, we're up to sixty-one fifty-seven. So that was a good little haul. Seventeen hundred pounds. That's eh, not great, but hey, we're doing okay. We're making progress. Slow and steady. Um, I'll pull this one in, and then I'll give you guys... I'll let you guys go, and then I will get everything else pulled in, then I'll bring you guys back in when it's time to sell, I think, is what the plan will be. Or at least when we're heading in to sell. How about that? Hopefully this boat... Well, if we get... Well, the, what we just pulled in, we did 4 out of the 20, which that's a fifth of it. So if we multiply that by 5, we should get 30,000 pounds of fish, theoretically speaking. So 30,000 pounds is definitely not going to fill the boat, so we probably could have done all, and there's some we could have speared over there, but... Anywho... We're doing fine. 30,000 pounds of fish actually should give us a decent chunk of cash. I believe the tuna price and swordfish prices are fairly high. Ooh. Surprised that... Well, I was surprised that worked out, actually. I was about to say, I was about to say that I was surprised it worked out, but I didn't know if it was going to work out yet. Two tuna on this? Come on. There is more tuna in the water there. Oof. Especially you need more tuna. They're only going to get okays. Oh, all right. Come on. Need a perfect. Ugh. Ugh, that was a good shot, too. That's okay. All right, let's see what we did on that one. 972 pounds. So, eh, we'll see. So, 7 times 5 is... Or 7 times 4 is 28,000. So, we lost a little bit on our average there. But, yeah. I'll get the rest pulled in, and then I'll uh, bring you guys back in once it's time to go sell them. All right, guys. Welcome back. So, we didn't quite get 30,000. 29,800, I think, is what we got. Uh, yep, yeah, looks like it. 29,000... Five is that was that five hundred? Uh, catch time all storage twenty nine thousand five hundred. Okay, so five yeah five hundred not eight hundred. So obviously I have mostly tuna. So let's go ahead and take a look and see uh, fish prices. 
I mean, Lunenburg, so Swordfish 17 and 19, that's great. Um, 16 and 17 still for Lunenburg. 17 and 19, 17, 49 and 43, 54 and 71, so still Lunenburg. Dennis Point, 17 and 19, but not as high. 17 and 1995. Oh, but that, but for the 95 and the tuna, that'll be worth it to go there instead. So Yarmouth, yep, Yarmouth is it. Yarmouth is the best of the best right now, so map. Um, we don't have to clean these guys or anything like that. So where is Yarmouth at? It's up here, isn't it? Yes. Yes, fast travel to there. Oh, we're going to make some good money, guys. I'm excited about that. So let's get over there and we'll get some money in the bank here. Okay. Weird how it doesn't, like, prompt you. Interesting. Anyhow, we're selling the catch. Look at that. Great prices. 1995, 1751. 551,000. That is... More than I thought we'd make, honestly, with what we uh, ended up ended up getting on here. And we got a little bit. We have a good reputation here, it looks like. So Fisher Magician, that's our reputation. That's quite the reputation. All right. Uh, yeah, sure. We, we sell them. <laughs> I don't know why. It's a little bit glitchy, but... Um, okay. Dock maintenance. We probably should buy some fuel. That gets us to, up to 748000 which if we go to the bank... Oh, uh, yeah. It still says we're too much in debt. Now, I know we can't pay anything off, but... Uh, we're still making some progress, slow and steady. Want to do something a little bit different. We might have to go out and trawl next uh, episode just to start paying some of our debt off. But uh, I'll see if there's any smaller ships that we can try out or maybe do some lobster fishing or something like that. So, anyhow, guys, that is going to end this episode. If you guys have enjoyed this episode, drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button up on your screen to join the GamerCop channel and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been GamerCop. Thank you guys for coming and watching.